Listen, if you can't pick up your woman safely, don't pick up your woman. This man tried. He didn't have the requisite strength. He wasn't Trey Songs. He didn't have the ability to safely transport his woman to the bedroom. She had obviously had a heavy night of worship and tearing. And, um, you know, he didn't support her neck. And now she has a concussion. And she doesn't remember what happened. All she had to do was get the Holy Ghost. And now she's got to go in and have an MRI. And a lot of people make fun of me because I'm a little overweight. I've got man boobs. And what I say to those people is they hate America. And at least I can carry my wife safely to the bedroom. Now, yes, she's very light, but that's beside the point. I can pick her up. And if you have a woman who's a little bit larger, she might be an alto, she sings in the heavy anointing choir, that's fine. If you can't pick her up, don't embarrass yourself and don't hurt her. Okay, he's not lifting with his legs. He's not supporting her neck. And now she's got an injury. Okay, this is, this is ridiculous, man. You got to get in the gym <laughs> or leave her. Tap her. Hey, daughter, God bless you. You almost got the Holy Ghost. You didn't get it. But listen, you got to wake up now and go on to your room. We're going to try again next week. Okay, don't pick her up if you can't safely get her to the bed. All right? It's dangerous out here in these streets. Y'all want these thin men, and that's fine, but don't ask them to do things they're not capable of. And sir, don't bite off more than you can chew. You knew you didn't have that in you. This ain't 2K. This is real life, baby boy. Real life.